there is a story a professor young professor not matured in life but very highly educated number of alphabets after his name <laughs> a long tail of alphabets was traveling by a ship and in the ship there was also a sailor a worker there a very old man illiterate sometimes he will come to the cabin of the professor listen to his words of wisdom what an intelligent person what a learned person wonderful person and one day after some talk when the old man was leaving the professor asked him old man have you studied have you studied geology what is geology sir i don't know i never been to any school i never been to any college please tell me what is geology geology is the science of the earth have you studied no sir as i said i have not studied anything oh old man so unfortunate you not studied geology you have wasted one quarter of your life the old man very sad his long face goes out such a learned person says i have wasted quarter of my life certainly i must have wasted quarter of my life next day when he came again after long talk when he was leaving again the professor asked him old man have you studied oceanology what is that sir the science of the ocean the sea oh no sir i have not studied anything what a unfortunate person you wasted half of your life old man very sorry i least wasted half of my life and third day again he was questioned old man have you studied meteorology what is this sir i never heard this name science of the wind the rain the weather no sir as i said i never been to any school or college i have not studied anything old man you are so unfortunate you have not studied geology the science of the earth on which you are living you have not studied oceanology the science of the sea on which you travel every day you have not studied meteorology the science of the wind the rain the weather which you encounter every day very unfortunate you have wasted 3 quarter of your life <laughs> old man very sorry i wasted 3 quarter of my life the next day it was the turn of the old man he came running professor sir professor sir have you studied swimology <laughs> what swimology can you swim sir oh no old man i can't swim i am so sorry professor sir <laughs> you have wasted all your life <laughs> there is a shipwreck now and this ship is going to sink those who can swim they will reach the shore there those who can't swim i am so sorry for you <laughs> we may learn all the logics of the world and we don't learn swimology then what's the use of all this logic <laughs> and swimology also if we keep on reading books on swimology and keep on discussing about swimology without touching the water then what is the use of this swimology as one has to learn actually how to swim because one has to swim the ocean of misery and this the other shore free from misery and this is dhamma this is the practical aspect of dhamma this alone gives benefit <laughs>